What is going on guys, Sonic and the Bean Show here and today we got a pretty interesting haul right here. So this past Sunday I went to a toy show in Jersey Shore which is kind of like Toy Con if you're familiar with that where it's basically like a whole bunch of like sellers selling like a whole bunch of like their collections and stuff like that. I wanted to film it for you guys but I wasn't sure if they were allowing that not only that but it was actually very very crowded and I ended up going there early I wasn't expecting to be that crowded. But I do have a short video of it. I did record it. I posted on my Instagram. But um, I will show it in this video. At least at the end of this video of course. And uh, yeah. We're really just going to get right into this. Um, I wasn't expecting to get all of this stuff. But um, I'm really excited to show you guys this. So let's start off with this one right here. Alright guys. So the first item right here is the Kid Robot Sonic Plush. Um, I think this is the thing where like. I guess if you touch it. It will like shake or whatever like that. Um, I'm actually going to get it out of this package right here. All right, there you go. That's better. Well, let me just take off his little skirt right here. So this is the tag right here. It's like a cool little Green Hill Zone background right there. And then, of course, Kid Robot logo. Remove battery tab. Hug me and I'll shake. You can clap your hands to the... Wait, really? All right, well, clearly uh, the batteries are dead, of course. Or maybe there's no batteries at all. But uh, this is the Kid Robot Sonic Plus. This is how he looks. It's a big Sonic Plus. I'm trying to get it all in frame. But uh, yeah, then this is the cool little tag he got right there. It's pretty cool. That's the uh, Sonic plush right there. Um, I thought that was pretty cool. I think I paid for about 40 bucks for this guy. Next up, guys, in this bag right here is a bunch of Funkos, as you can see. So this right here is the one that really surprised me right here. So this right here is a Courage the Cowardly Dog Funko Pop. I love Courage the Cowardly Dog, and I seen this and was like, oh my gosh, I gotta get that. So if you guys don't know, Funko released a whole bunch of, like, cartoon neck. As a matter of fact, I think, oh yeah, there you go. All right, sorry about that, guys. My camera wasn't focused right there, but uh, they released a whole bunch of like cartoon necro funkos they even released like powerpuff girls too but um you know i had to get courage i, I love courage and um and, you know, after watching the uh, courage and scooby-doo crossover movie you know i i just had to get one man like look at this guy next up guys is the sonic funko pop with the ring right here uh so this is oh yeah <laughs> Uh, yeah, pay 15 bucks for that dude. Uh, but yeah, this is um this is actually the uh the first modern Sonic Funko Pop I got. Uh, cause remember I had the classic one which I um showed off in the uh, collection video. Okay, that Super Sonic Funko caught me by surprise. I was not expecting. It. I didn't even know that existed. But of course, there's the rest you can't collect though. But uh yeah, that's really awesome Sonic Funko right there, man. Um, get that off there. But uh yeah, that's the uh Sonic Funko right there. That is so cool. And then of course it is a hot topic exclusive um however i think this funko is rare now i want to assume because you're not going to believe it but i paid like 30 bucks for this dude um but oh my god i had to bro look at that look at that but yeah man this is an awesome funko shadow man then here's the side right here the top other side bottom and then i think it's yeah it's about the same thing really all right guys so moving on to the last bag i'm sure you guys already see an item right here so this right here is a sonic comic book it's called sonic saga series darkest storm um, oh my god look at that egg man but yeah there was a seller selling a whole bunch of comic books and i just you know i came upon this and i was like oh my god that looks amazing oh check it out there's even another one right here it's a super sonic and a super shadow but um yeah i just looked at this comic book and you know i thought it looked pretty interesting i don't really have a lot of sonic comic books so um you know i i was like you know what you know why not you know <laughs> let me just get this all right so that was enough for sonic now on to some other things so this right here is a whole bunch of mega man pins right here and i also got this awesome mega man figure which i was really really looking for for the longest i'm actually gonna open this up because the packaging has like polka dots and it's making it look kind of weird all right so here is how it looks that's much better but yeah there's mega man rush and e-tank and beat right there i've also noticed i've been getting a lot of pens recently in my videos i'm probably gonna end up doing a a pen collection or something because i have so many pens now and then the next item right here is we got this awesome mega man figure dude check that out oh my gosh i was looking for this mega man figure for so long and then here's the rush figure right here it's like translucent though which is i don't know it's weird but uh yeah man i needed this mega man figure because i i only had the other one and i'm gonna show that actually right now all right guys so this is the mega man i was talking about so this was in wave two of the 66 action figures and this one was wave one um i only had this one i actually got this one recently not too long ago i showed it off on my instagram a while ago but um this is the one i was looking for and i'm glad i got him i only paid 10 bucks for him though i don't think that was really bad um 
I think that was their average price, I, I believe. But, um, yeah, uh, it's such an um, awesome Mega Man figure, man. I have been collecting more small Mega Man figures behind my videos, so, um, who knows? At some point, I'll probably do an updated uh, Mega Man figure collection. Alright guys, before I talk about this picture right here, I got some other things to show you before I move on to that. So check this out right here. So this right here is a Miles Morales face mask. And you guys know I love Miles Morales. So when I seen this, I had to get this. And you know, of course, anyone could wear the mask. So you know, it's like, come on, like you, I had to get that. I even got this black Spider-Man face mask. Now this looks cool. That is just awesome right there. Oh my gosh. But wait, there's more. I even got this Venom face mask. Check that out. Oh my gosh. Wait, hold on. I think it's upside down. Oh yeah, it was upside down. Okay. But oh my gosh. Look at the detail on this mask. Honestly, I wish I had this mask earlier. Because when Venom 2 came out and I pulled up with this mask. Oh my gosh. But you guys do know that Spider-Man season is this week, of course, um, because, you know, No Way Home is going to come out pretty soon. Um, I'm actually going to watch it Thursday. Some people are going to watch it earlier, like Wednesday, maybe even Tuesday, maybe. I don't even know. But all I know is, you know, I got to avoid spoilers. But when I do watch it, uh, I might end up wearing this one, of course. I don't know. All right. So now let's talk about this picture right here. So for those that don't know, this is a YouTuber named Silly Super Pop. And he was actually at the toy show, which was actually pretty cool. But yeah, this guy is grim. I got his signature and he put my name right there. I've been watching this guy since 2013. You know, he, he inspired me to make, you know, videos and have fun. And I, I just, you know, I just had to get a signature, of course. So that was really awesome. I, I just want to say thank you for that. Like, uh, I, I just can't, man. But yeah, I just had to show it off because this was such an awesome item. Um, he does like wrestling videos and things like that. So if you guys are interested, then, you know, check him out. He's pretty awesome. So this right here is a GTS shirt right here, which stands for Grimm's Toy Show. Um, You know, it's basically like his wrestling show and i got the, the you know the t-shirt like that that is just awesome that logo is sick too oh my gosh all right guys that was the haul right there so thank you so much for watching and i will definitely catch you guys in the next video take care my friends all right guys so update on the sonic plush so it turns out the batteries aren't actually dead and i'll show that right now so basically it was off this whole time <laughs> i just had to turn it on all right so now that it's on let's test it out <laughs> he's shaking all right stop stop <laughs> oh my god all right okay one more one more one more one more <laughs>